<laughs> Welcome to another summer on the Screen Squad. Like always, I'm Vinny. I'm Ozzy. Anna. Yeah, on this episode, we're talking about... Well, well, first off, I guess we have to preface this. Preface? Preface? Preface. Preface this. Prefaces. Prefaces is this. this. Prefaces is this? Yeah, we got to preface this that... Uh, well, we're, this episode is is we're we're talking about this one movie. Fools rush in because uh, um, we lost. We didn't lose. I mean, I mean, Matthew Perry died. Yeah, and no one lost anybody. He he passed away. I don't know why they say we lost him. It's not like he went anywhere. He's, his body's I mean, still was, there. There's always hope. They get, people always hope that there'd be a a friends reunion movie, or at least a, like something. They, they had, actually they like had a, they had a friends reunion on HBO Max. No, they had that. Yeah. They're like, did you know that we did this? Yeah, we did that. No, but like the characters have like something going on. They had a reunion. That's fine. That was that was more than enough. That was more than enough. Uh, but yeah, this uh, fools rush in. This is the reason why we're, we're talking about this movie, right? There was other movies, but we just unfortunately did not have the time. <laughs> but it's all right. Uh, <clears throat> we're we're talking about. Full re- full um, the I mean, movie- I didn't want to make it a month of Matthew, Matthew- Perry. Either. I mean, he only has like five movies. Yeah, he, he has a couple. Uh, but no, we- we're talking about full. That's Rishin. only two. A couple is two. A few is more than three, three or more. Uh, he had he had two with the uh, with Bruce Willis. Yes, and only one of them was good. <laughs> the first one. Is yeah, good. yeah, that's it. Uh, but, but, uh, no, but it's a fool's or shin. This movie really is, um, it's, it's, it's an, it's a, not, it's a fine movie. It's a, it's an okay movie. It's a romantic comedy, but I'm, I'm mainly watching it because of young Salma Hayek. In them titties. <laughs> wow. <laughs> hey, easy, bro. She's the one with the body. It's, it's in the movie. It's in the movie. If we're, if we're going to sexualize somebody and you point it out in the movie, we're gonna sexualize her and you know, point it out. We don't count me in your little. You're the, you're the only one. <laughs> you're the only one that's doing it. Oh sure, yeah, I'm the only pervert, right? No, no, no you're not yeah, the only yeah, pervert. Yeah, actually, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, but it's but this is one of those movies where There's it's your it, web <laughs> history. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> share, share your screen. Share your screen. Share your screen. Let's see what you're watching right now while we're talking about this. You shut your hole. Uh-huh. <laughs> no, I mean that's the, that's that's the name of that's the movie. You shut your hole. Part one or <laughs> part one or part nine. Uh, First of all, it's one of like thirty-two. So you <laughs> and, uh, and I never watch a full scene. <laughs> just 30, 30 second clips. Ah, so my hair. Uh, five minutes in, five minutes in, five minutes in, and those movies just kind of like go like, "This is bad acting." Yeah, yeah that's that's why you're watching yeah. it. Yeah, that's why you're watching it for the acting, for the story. You watch those for the story. Those aren't tears. Uh huh. Oh, why are your tears so milky white? What the? <laughs> Uh, there's, a, there's all that ectoplasm in the air. What's going on? You're watching <laughs> watching, watching, watching movies about ghosts. Yeah, it's in 4D. Oh, gross. <laughs> uh, no, but so full fools rush in, right? So the main, I mean, really, the main reason why I would watch it, I would, I would watch this before. I mean, let me still watch it just for young Salma Hayek, right? It's uh, because it it's pre Desperado, after Desperado, it's after, right? After Desperado? after, well after. after, yeah, well after, after. Des- after Desperado, uh, and you have you have you have you know young Matthew Perry. A fresh right like right where at the height of friends yeah like mid it was like between season two and three mm-hmm. so right at the, right at the height of friends and yeah it's not a bad movie it's like it's a it, it's it's just, it's just it's a romantic comedy about what happens to everyone you 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 bang a mexican chick and you get her pregnant done the end and then you have to That's deal a, with her you yeah. have to deal with her family yeah Right, uh, <laughs> that's pretty much. You the said whole to movie. my daughter. Do- you did that to my daughter. What? Well, I mean, I'm ah. sure. I, I'm sure. I'm sure that cop guy tried to do the same thing. Yeah, but it's okay because he's you know, brown. Yeah, yeah, but at least uh, <laughs> at least Alex Whitman, uh, who Matthew Perry pay- plays, has a lot of money. That's I mean, true. comes from money ish. I'm. I don't know if he comes from money. His, his family was well off <laughs> too. Yeah. Gross. Hmm? <laughs> yeah, but I mean, 
Yeah. She's a, the the movie is a romantic comedy. It has its moments where it's funny. It's uh, Matthew Perry playing, it's pretty much playing Chandler. I guess that's the reason why they they put him in this role because it's very close to his role in uh, role on Friends. Yeah, he's uh, charming but still awkward at the same time. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of the same character though, no? Yeah, kind of. It's kind of. I'm telling you, it's, it's it was typecast at that point. Very De Niro. Not not like De Niro in Killers of the Flower Moon, a 75 hour long movie. Oh. It's good, but too Enjoy. long. Good, but too long. It's good, but too long. That's all I'm going to say about that movie. But um, yeah, this this uh, it's it's not a it's not an incredibly like this this uh, Fools Rush In. It's not an incredibly complex movie. He he ends up getting uh, Selma Hayek's character pregnant. Right, he gets her character pregnant. And then from there, it's oh well. Let's they, they, they again, like the title suggests, they rush into marriage, right? And then yeah. the consequences of only fools uh, rush in. But he realizes that he's in love. That's why he wants to do it. Yeah, he mm. and and he does it, but he does it. Uh, he gets married, and then he does. He doesn't really know her. He didn't even. He didn't realize her. You know, didn't get her full last name. I'm sure, after thirty years, he still didn't know her. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. No one, no one knows. Do you really know anyone? Yes, true. Yes, you do. You get to learn new things about it, people all the time. People change. People mm. change constantly. Well, if I can change, then you can change. Everybody can change. <sighs> yep, Adrian. Rocky, Rocky Four. Rocky Four. Yeah. Uh, no, but I mean, the only thing, the only, my only problem with this movie. Is the fact that she has to lie to him and pretend that the baby get the baby? No oh, spoilers. Pretends that the baby, uh, she loses the baby, just to get just to just to get him out of her hair. But then the gra- yeah. the grandma makes the grandma has that whole speech to her like, nope, you, you didn't do this for you. Well, you didn't do this for him. You did this for you. You you, you didn't. Yeah, do- she didn't want him. Yeah, you're scared. You you don't want you don't want to be, you don't want to get so anyone so close to you. She didn't want him from the beginning. No. Nope. So what was she? She wanted something. Mm. Trying to get that bang. The Chandler bang? Yeah, that that bing bang boom. It was a bang. With the bang bang bang. Mm-hmm. With the bang bang bang. Oh yeah. Bang, 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 bang. Uh Mr. With a spoon. Yeah. R.I.P. Love me some with a spoon. You win some, <laughs> you lose some. You like to get with her spooned. Not that not some guy? Not some guy? Like, he was a gentle lover. Dad puns, huh? Dad puns. Uh, no, but like he, did, didn't he die? John Witherspoon, yeah. No, big pun. Uh, a long time ago. <laughs> I don't think. I don't know. A long time ago. <laughs> All right, there you go. We got. He was replaced by DJ Khaled. Yeah. First of all, my name is Doctor Oz. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, but okay, but. The movie, this movie, uh, was was it even that popular when it, when it first came out? It Full got thirty four percent on uh, Rotten Tomatoes. It has a thirty four percent. Right, but I know, I know that the movie, but I, it, did, didn't, it, it didn't uh, make, make money. money. No, no. Well, it came out the same time uh, they re released the original Star Wars on in theaters. So, and that one, <laughs> a, a movie from the from movie from the seventies, yeah, beats a, a movie with Salma Hayek. You know why? She's not because uh, she's not nude. You know that that could that could help. That, that could, could help. Hurt. But but she does a lot of the like cleaning and dancing at the same time. So it's that's Oh, that that's was one that was one thing. That's one thing about this movie. She decorated the house. Ugh. The mm. the colors the colors used and I was not I was not feeling what she how she uh, decorated yeah. the so, house. So 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 you're telling me so the family comes over and they decide to paint the house for you without yeah, but, but without your 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 like you know consent of what the color is you just have to say thank you like no this house is uh, hideous yeah. no mm-hmm. especially if you have an HOA in that area you know there's an HOA that that HOA is gonna like you know like fine you for like you know having a ridiculous color in your house mm-hmm. you know that's what you do. know the wife is always in charge in the home. <clears throat> Not not over the HOA. It doesn't matter. First of all, I don't care, Holmes. If so. you call her an HOA, she, you're gonna get oh, slapped. Stupid. She's the Hua. Oh, hua. Uh, 
<laughs> but still, like, but this, yeah, but I, rem- I remember when this movie, like, when this movie came out, I didn't, I don't remember. It. I mean, again, I was super, I was what, middle school, high school, something like that. When this movie I came liked, out, I actually really liked it. I liked it off the bat and I still like it now. Mm, it's, it's not a bad movie. No, I, it wasn't for me back then. And it's, eh, it's all right. It's, 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 it's all right. It's, it's not, yeah. It's a, ch- it's a charming movie. It's fine. It's a fine movie. Like, Matthew Perry is fine in this movie. Like he does, he does a fine role. Uh, Salma Hayek is Salma Hayek. Well, what am I gonna say? Salma Hayek. fix? You can't fix perfection. No. All mm-hmm. right, relax. Bro, she looks the same. She looks the same. She's perfection, bro. Easy, she's easy, perfection. Easy. Yeah, well, I'm talking about it, her performance. No, I know. I mean, her, I mean it, was, no, it wasn't her, that bad. Her no. accent's not that great, but you know, it's also you know adds to the charm. But it's not no, but it's not <laughs> super thick. Right, I, you, mm-hmm. I could understand everything she was saying. Well, it's easy. easy. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> I, just re- I just realized it. I just realized it. It's my bad. It's my bad. It's, it's her, her accent. Her, her <laughs> accent is not hard to understand. Like uh, you know, it's like it. It. It was like you could tell that those practicing of, of the English language to enunciate a little bit more. But yeah. I mean, but it's, it, it's, it's, it's a, nice. It was nice. It was nice to see a Latin woman in these movies around that time that looked like a Latin woman you would normally see. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Like you, not not these little you know super skinny little petite thingies. No, she was you know, she was huh. thick, bro. I mean, you could you two. could just five. She's she's five one. Yeah, she's she's you know, like thick can, thick with two C's, bro. Thick with two C's. Yeah, same. It's just it's. But I mean, had had this had this been nice. had this been written differently and taking place <clears> in Las <throat> Vegas, she could have been a stripper, a dancer, or a prostitute, right? Normally, that's what they, you, that's what you would get in one of these movies. Uh, she but was you, in Vegas, though. Yeah, that's just yeah, like being but in she Vegas. was a photographer. But she's a photographer, right? And so, yeah. I didn't. I again, I I don't mind this movie. This movie, I think, was fine for what it, for what it was. It's not something that I would like. Oh my god, it's one of the greatest movies I've ever seen. No, no, no. But it's it's, it's one of those movies. It's it's it's, it's okay. But if you think, but if you think of what you would have gotten before, because they ha- they were actually thinking of getting J Lo for that part, yeah. So thankfully, she said no. Yeah, God. She was she wasn't ready for a movie like that. Well, but that's what I'm saying like the cast she is because she said no to do she, Anaconda. That's with, a good movie with John. No, no, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> John. But John Lovitz, <laughs> John Lloyd. Uh, I mean, you mean Scar? <laughs> yeah, I can't believe you remember all that stuff. That's all I remember. I've only, seen, I've only seen that one. I've only seen that movie like once, and I'm like, I'll never and, watch it again. And an Ice Cube, yay, yay. That's all he does. That was, that was back when, like, most most of his roles were like, okay, now read the script. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna make him a Here's a snake. Let me hold on. Okay, yay, yay. All right, hey, hold on. That's his new line. He, just, he walks out the screen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, and walks off. That's it. <laughs> you have the part. And hold on, wait. And uh, yo, you think this is a game? All right, good. We're done. And see. <laughs> am, am I wrapped? Paycheck, wrapped? Okay, paycheck cool. please. Paycheck. Thank you. Everybody, come on. Wrap. He's wrapped. Cool. Let's go. Funny, like they, they catch uh, Ice Cube and the behind the scenes, he told like, oh, well, yes, I uh, studied at Juilliard. And then he comes in and like, <laughs> yay, yay. That's all he does. Done. <laughs> Like Urkel, <laughs> like, like Stephen Urkel. Urkel, yeah, uh, Stefan Urkel. Uh, no, but the, the the thing about this movie is that what I liked about it is the they had real good chemistry together, right? Like uh, Selma Hayek and Matthew Perry, they had they had yeah, chemistry. actually they did yeah they had they had chemistry like the cast it wasn't a big cast it was a small cast and the movie mainly revolved around them too and having to deal with number one getting married and have to deal with the pregnancy that she you know, she gets because she gets pregnant from the one night they're together right from the one night stand um, it happens and the two racist dads yeah I mean racist in different ways right they're they're both racist yeah. in their own way uh, but mm-hmm. also they have they had a point where they that these they rushed in and then but then they get into their hole. It's a, the, the differences in culture. Again, I th- I thought the movie was I thought the movie is fine. It um the chemistry was there. Is it something that back when I was younger would I have, like watched over and over again? No, not really. I mean, it seems it was it's it's of course it's a romantic comedy and it's geared towards you know 
dem- certain demographic back in the, and you can like back in the day, but it's uh, it's a fine movie. You guys, yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's the demographic. Uh, I mean, guys. any anyone who wants to watch Salma Hayek, <laughs> and, and and likes you know like like cheesy stuff. But you know what I liked was was in uh, one of my favorite parts is when when she introduces him to the family at that family get together, which is not really a family get together. You, you, you mean the every fa- Sunday the, night? the family dinner? You mean it's a family dinner, not even family get together. It's a family dinner. It's an actual party. Yeah, every it's Sunday. like a every Sunday night kind of thing. And when uh, when he's trying to like you know interact with like the tias and it's like oh, which one's deaf? And he's like he she thinks he thinks you're so and so. Huh? We all have the tias who can't hear, right? <laughs> If, it's, if we don't have one, it's probably us. Mm. You're, you're, <laughs> you're, the you're the tia. Yeah. So like, you're the tia. All right, cool. Makes yeah. sense. Make, <laughs> makes sense. Sometimes, 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 you know. <laughs> I might. Only sometimes when... I'm a tia. Sometimes I'm a tio. I'm a. Oh, <laughs> I, oh. I pick and choose my days. Only when the wife tells you what I need to be. <laughs> <laughs> Depends if I shave. Uh, and even then, H-O-A. it's kind of uh-huh. off. H-O-A. The HOA, there you're done. <laughs> I'm the hoa in the yeah. house. Yeah. <laughs> There's a hoa in this house. Uh, <laughs> But if you haven't seen Fools or Shit, I think it's a, it's a fine movie to watch. It's, I mean, I, it's one that you always said. It's say, a 90s. I think, it's I think a it, 90s romance comedy. And it's one yeah, of those. But it's but, not but bad, it's a, though. But, but it's it not a, bad romance comedy. But it is a movie that we you see um, a lot played around Valentine's Day, usually on TBS or TNT, right? On those channels. I always see it running on those channels. Always. Yeah. Yeah, and it's and it's running much, because much it like, gets traction. Much like people fe- like watching it. Much like in February, they would always show the Wiz. Hey, right? that, now that's a movie. You can I mean, win. Jay, relax. You're gonna have to ease on down on this one. Oil, <laughs> oil. Yeah. See, I'm next year. Next year, Russell. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's it's a movie that's always on. T- that's uh, for my every time, every year, it's always on TV a bunch of times during during like the Valentine's Day month during February. It's always on TV. Yeah, and it's and on Cinco de Mayo, and it's on TV for a reason because yeah, what is, that's 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 mm, messed up. But it's on TV for a reason because it's not a it's not a horrible movie. It's not a movie like <clears throat> that you can't watch a bunch of times because it's it's simple. It's sweet. It's it has not. It has you know. It has, good, it has a charm good, to it still. Though. Has good performances. You know, it they work together, and you know, and that's the one thing you can say about a lot of the Matthew Perry movies, that um, there's it's there's tr- there's chemistry. Like he, the movie, the movies that he did make, he has chemistry with all with the, with his cast, especially like again whole whole nine yards, a whole ten yards. There's does the chemistry within that whole cast, right? Yeah, him, Bruce Willis, Michael Clark Duncan. Yeah. Uh, almost, yeah. almost heroes with Chris Farley. Even though that movie's not the funniest, there's good chemistry between him and. You mean you mean Wag is East? One. Almost heroes. They're all, it's almost heroes. Who did Wag is East? That was uh, Candy. Was, no, that was John Candy. Oh, that's right. You stupid idiot. Different fat guy. Actually. Well, you could have <laughs> said me. I was in that movie too. We just <laughs> stupid fat guy. No, but then you'll it'll just be another. It would just uh, be another one, dumbass. With your mic. <laughs> See, that's what you get. That's what you get for talking shit. Easy, ra- easy wagons east. <laughs> Little known fact: Ozzy was the, south. Ozzy was a I wagon. Was the wagon. He was a wagon. Yeah, yeah I figured. <laughs> Dick, Sir, you can't park your wagon here. Oh, that's just a fat guy. Yeah, it's just a fat guy. It's just a fat guy. Yeah, uh, yeah. No, uh, no, but this movie's. Super charming because Matthew Perry plays super charming on the show. He plays and it, tra- and it translated Perry. well in this movie with yeah. uh, alongside with you know Sama Hayek's. You know she had a charm to her too that you kind of hated her at some point. She had liked lines. Her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> in dance. The movie was on mute. What are you uh-huh. talking about? I read lips. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Yeah. I'm gonna pass out. Uh, no, but there is that. Is there is that certain? There is that charm. Like some, some <laughs> high. <you know? laughs> Stupid. But there is there is that char- there, like you said there is that charm. They, they, well, here he goes. Here he goes. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Speaking oh. of Chris Farley, yeah. Just another heart attack. It's fine. Oh no, but yeah, it's just... bears. <laughs> Here, wash it down with this hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. 
<laughs> How about, I, but, I need my donkeys. No, but like you said, like <laughs> it's that it's that charm the movie has, and there's a, that's why that's the reason why this movie above like a lot of the other Matthew Perry movies, this one stood the test of time. It is constantly played on TV, and it's just it's one of those movies that people still like would watch, even to this day. It's it's because it's a. Cause it's a, cause it's a, cause it's a, it's a charm. Like you said, charming movie. It's the, 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 the performances are, are, the performances are good. The story's simple, right? And there's really, it, it's, it's, it's a movie made for like anyone who wants to watch it will enjoy, like really, you, you'll find something to enjoy in this movie. That's the thing. Like yeah. you're not going to be bored and you're not going to say this movie was horrible. Unlike, you know, like, like, of course, like, like you said, Rotten Tomatoes gave it a, it has a low score, but who, yeah, Rotten matter. Tomatoes is garbage, though. You can't, you can't at this, trust at this, at, at this point, you don't, you don't trust, trust yeah, the critics. Well, you trust, didn't it come people. out that Rotten Tomatoes got paid off to like give people certain ratings? Well, it, it wasn't it originally. Well, they're, all, made, they're also it? easily like manipulated to, you know, so people get bad scores too. So, but wasn't it originally made by Warner Brothers? Rotten Tomatoes? I, I have thought no idea. It, I thought it was originally made by Warner Brothers, but whatever. Something like that. Something. Mm-hmm. So that's why you don't. Shady that's like why you, that. that's why you, what what what's you annoying is is what's annoying is that Rotten Tomatoes, they get uh they get you know worked worked over by so many people that people put so uh put uh put to oh uh, la can't think right I'm so upset about it. I am so uh, angry. <laughs> give me a. I hot... am so mad right now. Hey, give me a uh, hot dog, please. <laughs> <laughs> Wipe away these tears. Oh. I need to wash it down. No, but they they what they do is they. They end up giving movie scores that are super low that or super high before they even get released. Yeah, like the Marvels is probably getting really high scores, and because and I know it's gonna be trash because Brie Larson's in it, but whatever. And it's no, gonna what, it's gonna bomb. No, because they did that with uh with uh with even the crap movies like The Flash, because this movie had better CG than the well, Flash. Well, they remember they also paid. <laughs> they, remember they always they also paid off. Uh, they also paid off uh, Tom Cruise to say The Flash is the best comic movie he's ever seen in his life. That was real cinema, mm. right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but you I'm know, like, he, I'm like, did Tom Cruise watch the same movie I saw? Because <laughs> Hey, all I know is, yeah. are they, are, like, are, whoever paid them off, are they helping them with the, the next Mission Impossible movie? Oh. Uh. Mm. Mm. But, but Tom Cruise does watch like 17 movies in one day because he can do that. He loves cinema. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, because he, he has, uh, he has the he world in theater money. in his home. Yeah, he has the world <laughs> in money. Like he doesn't, he doesn't have to, he doesn't have to make another, another uh, Mission Impossible movie. He shows up. He goes, "I want that." Mm-hmm. Take it. That's what he said about Penelope Cruz. He showed up. He said, "I want that." Yeah. So that would be mine today. He just called up Scientology. Never mind. Uh, hey, hey, hey. we <laughs> do not speak ill of them because you know they will come for our homes. Zenu. <laughs> uh, no, but if you haven't seen Fools Rush In, right? If you haven't seen Fools Rush In, I'm Russian, fading free. I'm fading free. If you. Uh, if you haven't seen Fools Rush In, I would I would recommend. I mean, I would recommend it. It's not a horrible movie by any means, saying that it's like it's trash, right? But that the same thing I could, I would say again. If you haven't seen Seventeen again, you know that Matthew Perry is in. If you haven't would seen you? the whole nine yards, if you haven't seen the whole ten yards, I mean, whole nine yards is a lot better. But if you haven't seen the whole nine yards, if you haven't seen, I mean. If you haven't seen Almost Heroes, that's that's another. That's fine. It's not the greatest, but it's fine. It's another uh, fine wagon movie. Or, or if, wagons, if he... or wagons East, <coughs> or uh, or like Matthew Perry's best movie, Uncle Buck. <laughs> <laughs> or that one episode of Growing Pains that you know he's in. Yeah. <laughs> or 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 three the to great tango. Outdoors. Three to tango. Three to tango. It's another movie. Three to tango. It's yeah, another yeah. good movie. Right. Yeah. So there's there's a few movies that Matthew Perry has done that you know. R.I.P. R.I.P. Duncan Sheik. <laughs> R.I.P. King. Uh, <laughs> ov- but overall, I, if you if you haven't seen the, the the movie, you should because it's again like I said, there's good chemistry in it. It works. It's fine. It's Summer Hikes in it. That's all you need to know. <laughs> <laughs> and that's just great. And I was gonna say that's it. how I know Matthew Perry from the movies, <clears throat> not from Friends, because <clears throat> I I didn't watch Friends. I never liked that show. Your Sorry, kid, everybody. Your kids like it. Your yeah, daughter. my kids do, yeah, but yeah. but I never liked that show. Is this not real New York? But yeah, I mean, it's, all it's the New, premises were It's ridiculous. New York via the Warner Brothers lot in Burbank, California. <laughs> yeah, and there's no there's no one be like, hey, suck a dude, like nothing. Like there's no people yelling <laughs> that out. Like 
I want a chopped cheese. Ah, Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Like no, nobody saying. gets pushed on the train <laughs> yeah. tracks. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna go to the store. No, you mean the bodega? Yeah, no, no, <laughs> one's his, no, one's, no one's his dad. Like, let me go get a slice of pizza. Well, get a little za in nah, my hands. Come on now, yeah. make it realistic. All, make it realistic. Cheese, maybe pepperoni. Talk about the pickpockets. Talk about the stabbings. Mm. Yeah, I mean, no, no. there's not that that one episode where like you know, Chandler gets mugged and molested on the on the train. No, it's it's just. It, it, the episode doesn't exist, and uh, there's and there it are no does on your website. And, and, yeah, that's true. <laughs> Deep cuts, bro. Deep cuts. R- rotten. dot com. <laughs> rotten. dot com. Uh, but on that on that note, it's, on that it's, note, it's it's actually rim. dot com. But okay. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Well, the, for real. On that note. On that note. This yeah, is. This, I think. This, cut the end. Yeah. This has been Vinny. Don't, don't open Pandora's box, bro. Don't open Pandora's box. <laughs> Another. Dazzy. Another movie you watch. We'll, uh, <laughs> and, and Edgar. We'll see you guys. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. All right. Wagons yeah. East.